This video is sponsored by HP. So these days, it seems like many people, myself included, looking for one device to rule them all. Uh, one that I can slip into my backpack and take with me anywhere that I can do all the tasks than I can think of. Uh, that's what HP is hoping their Dragonfly Pro will step in and let you create and work in the most seamless way possible. Before I tell you about that seamless way possible, let me do a giveaway. Thank you for being you, for being awesome, for being generally good human supporting the channel all these years. We are giving away, drum roll. We're actually changing it up a bit. We are giving away a Dragonfly Pro. Open to anyone in the world. Leave a comment down below, let me know what you do with your HP Dragonfly. Tell me a joke, tell me a story, just leave your social handle in the comments so I can contact you if you win. Let it run for 10 days. All information though will be in the description. I've been called a lot of things, but perhaps I am shallow, but when I buy really any tech product, the aesthetics matter to me. I want it to feel like something important. I want it to look like something good. So this is made of recycled metals and plastics, which gives a case, I think a really interesting kind of look and feel. So first you can tell it's metal, but it's not like other laptops out there. And if you look closely, you can actually see sort of a texture they don't get in sort of the other laptops there either. Whether you get the sparkling black, which we have, or the ceramic white color, which I have not seen, but looks awesome. I think you're gonna dig the look and feel of this case. And it just, it feels, you know, some things just feel good. Uh, that quality moves to the inside as well. Uh, keyboard looks and feels great to type on. I also really like the font on there too. It's, it's unique, but very readable. Oftentimes with laptop, maybe this is a personal thing, but the trackpads on these computers are either too wide, too narrow, or hard to use. I really like the trackpad here on the Dragonfly Pro. Uh, it's using haptics to simulate a click, which is I think generally pretty good, less moving parts, uh, and it works really well. Uh, no lag at all, and it's also big enough to do all your scrolling. Next thing I care about is the screen, whether it's a phone or a computer, I need the screen to look good. That is your portal to everything that this thing can do. And HP makes some of the best screens out there. Uh, it's a 14 inch full HD display. It's a touch screen as well. I think 14 inch is kind of a perfect middle ground for everything, especially a laptop like this. It gives you enough space to work on and to view the content that you need. Uh, one area that HP really focused on, the Dragonfly Pro, is the camera and speaker experience. They've been kind of working on this for years. Uh, you can see the speaker grill on the side of the keyboard, and underneath there's a quad speaker setup that is tuned by Bang & Olufsen. And again, for years, HP's been working on laptops and their speakers, and that's true here. You can see sort of that work come through, at least hear it. Uh, you can play the speakers at up to 80 decibels without any distortion, so that not you're taking a conference call or watching a movie or just listening to music, you're going to get a great audio experience here. Uh, and for the webcam, you're getting a five megapixel FHD camera with one touch optimization. So you can adjust things like background blur or framing. Uh, plus the camera enables Windows Hello, base detection, and human presence detection. So yeah, you're not a vampire. Those are all important, but actually things a computer have to do. Uh, IO is super important here as well. You've got two Thunderbolt 3 ports, which I think is pretty good considering the overall form factor of this thing. It is generally thin and light. So, I.O. for pretty much whatever you might need. Uh, Design-wise, it looks really good. The hinge feels solid as well. It doesn't have kind of floppy hinge syndrome like you get. Don't laugh, but you know what I'm talking about. You've had a computer with a floppy hinge. Uh, this one is actually designed really well and pretty solid. And the computer itself looks and feels good. It's a hard thing to convey in video, but if you pick this thing up and you hold it, you'll be like, oh, John, you were right. This thing looks good. And it's a great laptop to do anything you need, to get work done, to you know play some like gaming, to just having a computer with you. It's gonna be able to get that job done. And I think to get that job done, performance matters. I think you wanna know that the power is going to be there as well. HP chose to use AMD Ryzen chips in here. Actually, you get up to a Ryzen 7. It's the 7736U mobile processor with Radeon graphics and up to 32 gigabytes of RAM and a one terabyte PCIe NVMe SSD. So with this, HP was trying to accomplish, at least I think, two main things. Uh, first is to have pretty good power that competes with the competition on the market, um, whether it runs Windows or not. Uh, and if you're wondering what the benchmarks are, here's uh, what we saw in our tests. 
another benefit of having all this sort of built in is gonna be battery life. And a real world use, you can probably expect 12-ish hours of multitasking use, which is a ton. And one of the big reasons that this computer is so efficient and powerful and gives you that good battery life is HP gave it some extra love on the processor side. They custom tuned it to work with this system, which is why you're getting all of those efficiency things that ordinarily you wouldn't expect uh, from a laptop. I think we've all come to expect excellent battery life in our devices and HP has delivered uh, that here. So with all the power inside, you can use this laptop for hours uh, at a time. There's also a dedicated button for 24 seven pro live support. It's not a button that you want to hit, but if you ever do have to hit it, you'll get a live agent sort of there to help you whenever you need. Again, hopefully you don't need to, uh, but if something does go wrong, it's nice to know you've got that sort of almost built into your computer to get something fixed or looked at for you. So everything that we do and buy has a footprint. Sustainability is something that is, is pretty important to HP. And that's why like this computer is part of the most sustainable PC portfolio going. It might not be something that's always top of mind, but it is pretty important. The Dragonfly Pro is a computer that excels at a lot of things. There are computers out there that might do one or two things better. But if you want a laptop that's gonna deliver excellent battery life, incredible build quality, a great typing experience, good trackpad, uh, really good webcam as well with incredible audio, this is everything that you can need uh, for portability and computing. If you wanna learn more about it, I got a link down below to learn more about the HP Dragonfly Pro.